In this video, we're going to learn how to set up a C++ development environment using Visual Studio on Windows. So the first thing we'll do is Google for Visual Studio. And if you click on the first link that comes up and then scroll down, we want this link here, Download Visual Studio, and we're going to pick Community 2022. When we click on this, we should get this installer downloading. We'll click on that to open it up. So this program will install Visual Studio. Eventually it'll pop up with a bit of a wizard and we'll go through that wizard. So we'll say continue. It says downloaded, installed, getting the installer ready. And we'll just have to make sure we pick the option that allows us to make C++ programs. So for workloads here, we're going to scroll down a bit. And there's one here that says desktop development with C++. We want that one. So click that box. Then we'll go to install and we'll allow it to install. Now this process will take a while. So I'll skip ahead to after it's done. And so eventually we'll get here where it says done installing and we can say, okay, and you can go to launch here. Or you could also go to search here and type in Visual Studio and it'll come up that way. You could also go here and scroll down to V and go to Visual Studio that way. But we'll launch it and then we'll make a C++ application. So I'll click on the program in the taskbar here and that'll bring up this window that tells us the application is going to take a while to start up. So the very first time you run it, it will take a little bit longer to start up because it's still doing some configuration work. Eventually we'll get to a window that will allow us to create a new project or pick from recent projects as well. So once we get to this screen here, we can go to create a new project. And then we're going to pick here console app. So we'll pick console app and we'll go to next. And we'll call the project Hello World. So where it says project name, we'll say Hello World. And then we'll click on Create. And this will bring up a bit of a Hello World application for us as a starting point. So it says Creating Project. And we get this window here. Now you can zoom in a bit with your mouse or with control plus and control minus. There's also all kinds of options in terms of changing the font size and whatnot of the editor here. But what we're given is a basic bare bones Hello World C++ program. And we can compile it by clicking this play button here. And this will compile and run our program. And we should get the text Hello World popping up in a command prompt. And we get it right there. It says hello world right there. Now, if there's an issue compiling our program where there's an error, we'll get that as well. So we'll delete the semicolon and then we'll save this file here. And now we'll try to compile it again. So this time there's a pop-up and it says, would you like to continue and run the last successful build? We'll say no. And if you go here down to the, the bottom here, it's going to show you where your errors are. So here it says expected a semicolon. And if you double click on that, it's going to bring you to the place in the file where that's occurred. So this is how we can get started with a C++ development environment on Windows using Visual Studio. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.